Hi, grade one. Today is another day of us practicing with long vowel A and all the ways that we've learned how to spell it. But since we've already learned this and we've done two days of sounding out, for the next couple of days we are going to do dictations, which means I'm going to say the word and you are going to spell them. So you are going to need your dry erase board and dry erase marker. And all the words are going to be spelled either AI or AY. And you should know which one to use because if you hear a sound after the A, it's going to be AI. And if you hear A at the end of the word, it's going to be AY. So the first word that I'd like you to print is say. Say. And you should have put a Y at the end because you hear it at the end. S a. Change say to sail. Then you should have changed the a Y to a I because you hear a in the middle. S a o. Change sail to mail. Mail. Not s ale, but m ale. Change mail to main. Main. M A N. Change main to May. It's almost the month of May. May I go to school? No. May. A Y at the end. Change May to tray. I have a tray of food. Tray. Tray could be a little tricky because you need to hear tur, not ch. Tur. Change tray to trail. I like to walk on the Bruce trail. So you should hear ol at the end, which means you have to change it to ai. Change trail to snail. A snail will leave a trail of goop behind it. Trail to snail. So what do you think, Joelle? Is that enough? Yes? Okay, cool. We will move on to Go Noodle time. Hi everybody, I'm Eric. Get ready to turn it up with some dance moves. Here we go. All right, I just want to thank you for listening today. And right now, in the top 20, this is song number one for the third week straight. This is Turn Up the Bass. Call me right now, let me know what you think about this one. Let's go. Yeah, here we go right now. No playing around. When it's all said and done, we gon' have. 
To reread the story, um, you get to read some, and your child gets to read some, all depending on where they are with their reading. So take turns as well as it goes. And then again, we have four pages of phonics. If your child is super duper good at these and it's easy for them, they should do all four. If it's a little bit harder, they get to pick which three they would like to do. Uh, long A, short A, all AI words matching. Short vowel, long vowel. This is a good one to do. And the sentences, and these all have a Y. And today's um, reading comprehension story is all AI. Remember? The answers need to have a little bit of the question inside. So what did Gail have that was long? She had... What did Gail wait by when it rained? She waited by... Why could you not see Gail if she laid on the stone? You couldn't see her because... Here's even the word because... Synonym for stain. A synonym is a word that means the same and a picture of the story. And then optional, we're going to change the sentence from a telling sentence to an asking sentence, just by putting a different word at the beginning. Our class is going on a field trip, is. So if you just put the is in front, it will change it to a question. So same thing. You, could can change these telling sentences to an asking sentence by putting an asking word at the beginning. 
Grandpa gave Ted a puppy. So an asking word could be is, where, who, did, what, why, those kinds of words. But optional. Reading, though, is not. Please do read for 10 to 15 minutes. All right, that's it for today.